welcome to Elvis Week 2008. Elvis Week is a uh, candlelight vigil. Everything centers around uh, the night of the 15th. Uh, of course, this is all about Elvis. It's not about the performers, uh, or at least it should be. Uh, and it's strictly a dedication to Elvis. They have a candlelight vigil on the night of the 15th. Um, and it's, uh, they, they have a, a uh, memorial about nine o'clock, and then they have the walk up, which everybody has candles. They walk up past the grave. Uh, pay their respects to Elvis and then walk down, back down. It's a real uh, somber and um, emotional time, especially if it's the first time you've gone through it. It's, uh, it will really get you. Uh, they, um, they have speakers set up along the drive and they, of course they play Elvis and uh, a lot of the songs they play are kind of some more of the moody music Elvis sang and it just, uh, it really kind of chokes you up. First time you've been to it and uh, every year it still gets you but it's, uh, that first time is, is really the, the one that gets you? Actually, uh, I guess it kind of started out as a joke. Somebody asked me because I used to sing with some band to do some Elvis and I did it. Somebody wanted me to come and do a party and I did it. And somebody wanted me to do another party and I did it. So it just kind of grew from there. <laughs> Someone 
festival or Elvis event that you'll go to um, for one it, it's right here where Elvis lived all those years and, and his spirit is here I mean you know you look up at Graceland and, 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 and I've been to Graceland probably 30 times toward it more than that and when you look at that house something comes over you and I, I think that spirit of Elvis that is here in Memphis in this area uh, adds adds to the um, the atmosphere um, and, and, and this is like a meeting place. I mean, some of these people <clears throat> that are here, uh, it, it's kind of like a, a reunion for us because we only see each other maybe once, twice a year, but we always know when we come to Memphis that we're all gonna reunite at, you know, over Elvis. You know, We're all here because of Elvis. And uh, I would say this is definitely, if, if you want to get your Elvis fill you know, for a festival, Elvis week is, is the ultimate. I mean, it's the ultimate uh, Elvis experience. Well, I actually spoke to someone. Some someone who I spoke to is actually with me this trip. And for a couple of years, I've been telling him that I've been going to Graceland. And then he turned around. And he said to me, he said, "Oh, by the way, he said, are you going to Graceland next year?" And I said, "No." <laughs> There's a duck fly. And I said, "Man, of course I'm going to Graceland." And he just said, "Can I come with you?" Said, Nothing stopping you. And now he's waited all his life. I think he's, what, he's 43. He's waited all his life as an Elvis fan to come to Graceland. And I cannot pin that man down. He is running around like a headless chook. He cannot believe he's in Graceland. And he's meeting people that feel the same way he is. Total strangers that make him feel more welcome than his own family and friends. And he's, he's already talking about coming back next year. So. That's what you tell a person. You gotta, you gotta feel it to believe it. And I'd say that to anybody. You know, well, I went to Graceland and uh, I didn't really think that the house was all that great. And I, it's not as big as I thought it was. And I said, well, hell, man, it's a home. It's not, it's not a museum. It's not Las Vegas. Somebody lived there. You know, it's your choice. You know, but as soon as you walk onto Graceland. On the Graceland Drive, everything just goes. It changes. You know where you are. You know where you are straight away.
And I never think of you Basically playing a part, and and you get into character, and you and uh, like my forensics teacher told me in high school, you once you're in character, you stay in character. My name is Cody Slaughter, and you're watching Walking on the Boulevard. Yeah. 